What is Hartley Oscillator? Hartley Oscillator is inductively coupled variable frequency oscillators where the oscillator may be a series or shunt fed. Hartley Oscillators is the advantage of having one tuning capacitor and one center taped inductor. This processor simplifies the construction of a Hartley Oscillator circuit. Hartley Oscillator circuit and its working. An NPN transistor connected in a common emitter configuration works as the active device in amplifier stage. R1, R2 are biasing resistors and RFC is the radio frequency choke which provides the isolation between AC and DC operation. At high frequencies, the reactance value of this choke is very high, hence it can be treated as an open circuit. The reactance is zero for DC condition, hence causes no problem for DC capacitors. The CE is the emitter bypass capacitor and RE is also be a biasing resistor. The CC1 and CC2 are the coupling capacitors. The circuit diagram of a Hartley oscillator is shown here. When the DC supply VCC is given to the circuit, the, the collector current starts raising and begins with the charging of the capacitor C. Once capacitor C is fully charged, it starts discharging through L1 and L2 and again starts charging. This back and forth voltage waveform is a sine wave which is small and leads with its negative alteration. It will eventually die out unless it is amplified. Now the transistor comes to the picture. The sine wave generated by the tank circuit is coupled to the base of the transistor through the capacitor CC1. Since the transistor is configured as common emitter, it takes the input from tank circuit and inverts into a standard sine wave with the leading positive alteration. Thus the transistor provides amplification along with inversion to amplify and correct the signal generated by the tank circuit. The mutual inductance between L1 and L2 provides the feedback of energy from collector emitter circuit to the base emitter circuit. Now let's look into the advantages. Instead of two separate coils L1 and L2, a single coil of bare wire can be used and coil grounded at any desired point along it. By using a variable capacitor or by making core movable, that is varying the inductance, frequency of oscillations can be varied. Very few components are needed, including either two fixed inductors or a taped coil. The amplitude of the output remains constant over the working frequency range.